We've heard from old timers and newcomers both that you enjoy a look at what Denver was. Anybody remember Bob's place? It was a gas station that people loved, for real. Bob's place was a filling station at the corner of Colorado Boulevard and Alameda. At the time it was built, in 1929, Colorado Boulevard was just a dirt road. I'm Bob Alder. This is my race shop where I'm the proud owner of the Bob's Place Howdy Folk sign. So there's a lot of nostalgia surrounding Bob's Place. I did quite a bit of research on it and on this filling station and, and on Bob Gilmore, the owner of the station. You know, there's a guy that spent his life on that corner servicing people. He only had one arm, so that was kind of unique. And I'm sure a lot of people went to that station when they could have gone to many other stations. In fact, his house was right next door to the station. So he'd go over, have lunch, and if somebody came up to the station, he'd leave the house, come over, service the car, you know, and then go back and finish lunch. So that's the kind of thing people remember. I mean, that's pretty unique. That doesn't happen these days. No, nah, filling station is a filling station now. They're all the same. So when I, in 94, when I saw that the building was being torn down, it was like, oh my gosh, what's going to happen to that sign? Oh my gosh, my name's Bob. Oh my gosh, would it be great to have a sign that says Bob's Place? When people see it and remember it, it's a pretty nice thing. Pretty nice thing to be able to preserve it. Bob learned the other piece of the Bob's Place sign, the side with the, the Bobcat in the suit, is somewhere in Arizona. He's trying to track it down and put the sign back together in his shop.